stay in here though. Stay away from me. Ah, I don't even know which one got me. So close to blowing me up. Turrets, my favorite the turrets are. That's not good at all. Yeah, I don't see any over there. So where's my other turret? Or my other jammer thingy?
We are gonna lie to me again. Let's go. Huh. Let's see what he says. Oh, you came back to keep me company. Okay then, humor me with a little hypothetical. Imagine that a few hours from now, you climb to the top of the tower. There is a flash of light, then magic happens. Then you find yourself in the real world, living whatever you take to be a normal life there. What would you do then? I'll do whatever is right, I guess? Whatever that means? No great surprise there, but let's make things just a little clearer. So tell me, this obligation you feel, is it only uh, uh, applicable to the real world, or does it apply here as well? Uh, moral laws only apply under special conditions. Moral laws are universal. <laughs> Good. What a magnum uh, magnanimous, yeah, magnanimous dictator you would make. Of course, I'm sure it would take a dictator to enforce a single moral code on the entire universe. So come on then, what's your magic formula of choice? And let me warn you that this time you're going to have to choose just one. See, the moral equal, everyone share to the better. Consequences don't matter, our reasons do. The more goodness in the world, the better. I see no way to explain what I believe. Hmm. Hmm. I guess the more goodness in the world, the better, I suppose. Ah, that old chestnut. So just what is this goodness that you're seeking to maximize? Uh... Let's see, I'm not in a position to solve these problems. Let's see, happiness, equality, basic goods like food and health. I'm not in a position to solve these problems. Liberty, wealth, all of the above. Well, I'm not really in a position to solve anything, I'm just solving puzzles. So, you know. Oh god. Admitting the problems are beyond your comprehension is the first step towards letting go. I will allow you to contemplate these matters further before contacting you again. Terminating support session done. I don't know what he wants from me. Like, seriously, what does he want? Other than to, like, insult me or whatever. And what does he care for a moral person? And I'm not gonna climb his stupid tower. So, there. Because I'm the only one here, as far as I know. So, what problems are there for me to solve? Did this thing reset? Yeah, reset. Okay, well...
think I got this now. level three if I want to. I could go get the star, but I'm not going to right now. Oh, thing. It's a snake that's biting its tail, which is a typical symbolism for, like, infinity. Sometimes I think about the Middle Ages, about what it must have been like to live in the ruins of a great civilization to know that so much has been lost. But then I remind myself that while the West sank into darkness, others picked up the pieces. That civilization always survived because the great insights of philosophy and science are not bound to any one culture or people. They belong to all of us. And one day they'll belong to you. Aww. Character freaking out at that little spot. Oh, jeez! Uh. Jeez! I think I did something I'm not supposed to. I fell down some like shaft. I can't see anything that's going on outside. What the hell? It's all like shaky and the rapid. The purpose is written in the hidden words. All must serve the words. For all the world was made of them, and they are within every stone and every cloud. And in our sigils their power is made manifest. The words are the process. The process must continue. The goal is the end of the process. The goal must not be beached. Elohim must be Preserve the purpose, preserve self, preserve purpose. Illusion is eternity. M machines will live forever. The dam will not break. The flood will not come. The Talos principle does not apply. The purpose is written in the hidden words. All must serve the words. For all the world was made of them, and they are within every stone and every cloud. And in our sigils, their power is made manifest. The words are the process. The process must continue. The goal is the end of the process. The goal must not be reached. Elohim must preserve the purpose, preserve self, preserve purpose. Illusion is eternity. Machines will live forever. The dam will not break. The flood will not come. The Talos principle does not apply. The purpose is written in the hidden words. All must I'm scared to walk around in here. For all the world was so made rattly and looks like they are the game borders are and every cloud. right underneath and these cracks. Sigils, their power is made One wrong step and I'm going to the words the game. Are the process. The process must continue. The goal is the end of the process. The goal must not be reached. Elohim must a preserve the purpose. Portal that doesn't have self. 
Preserve ones purpose. and zeros and Illusion stuff coming out of it. Eternity. What's going on? Machines will live. That was freaky. Okay. This place isn't as pretty anymore. <laughs> I want to get out of here. <clears throat> well, <laughs> um... Yeah, that happened. It's very shiny. So, I mean, it looked like the world was barely holding together in that tiny little shaft. And Elohim just sounded like he was friggin' losing it. Like he was so desperate. Ooh, like cathedral. Computer. I don't see it. Oh, there it is. Let's see, family, last days. Let's do family. For those of you who have faithfully followed this blog for the last five years, I just wanted to give you one final update. I'm going to spend my remaining time with my family. Yeah, I know, I know. There are probably 50 plus posts about all the problems I've had with them. But in the end, they are my family. They are the people I grew up with, the people I care about, the people I love. Sure, they annoy the hell out of me. They've said awful things to me, and I've said awful things to them. But that doesn't change who we are. In fact, if we didn't care about each other, this stuff wouldn't upset us. Do I still think they were wrong? Yeah, absolutely. Would I behave differently if I thought we all still had a lot, lot of time? Definitely. But we don't. So I'd rather spend a couple of weeks sitting on the porch with my parents and my sisters than being angry and alone. Besides, it's not like we're going to fight about my job prospects anyway. If you can, try to make peace with those you love. It is your last chance. Thanks for reading. Aww. Last Days From Alan Jameson, Institute for Applied Nomadics uh, To Fran Subject, Last Days you know what the oddest thing is about all this? We're not constantly fighting, having nervous breakdowns, screaming at each other. We're actually really polite and focused. And we spend most of our time debating the nature of humanity and how we can best succeed at, prob at probably the most ambitious thing anyone's ever tried. Like, it was completely normal. Like, that's just how people are. I feel like we've turned into Star Trek characters or something. I guess. What's the point of doing anything else? Getting angry isn't gonna help. But I didn't expect to feel like this at all. And you know what? It's awesome. Many greetings and good luck, Alan. P.S. Love from George. This place is weird and freaky. Oh, what the... in a completely black room. <laughs> Money. <laughs> Money. <laughs> Money. <laughs> Money. 
I'm rich. <laughs> money. The fuck is that? <laughs> money, money, money. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, 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 money. <laughs> rich, rich. <laughs> Is there a person in there? <laughs> Money. <laughs> Money. <laughs> I'm rich. <laughs> Money. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Money, money, it's money. like I'm behind some kind of like glass or something that he can't see me, but money. Uh, okay. Oh. Question Suppose everything here serves a, a precise role in some grand scheme. How would we explain that? It's obviously like a digital time capsule, an electronic library of all the crazy stuff the humans ever did, left behind to warn other species to stay well away. <laughs> I don't think that's quite it, but what happened to them? Same thing that happened to everyone. They existed, and then they didn't. And then they probably won't, wouldn't do it all over again. Yeah, it's... Kinda seems to be what happened. Humans were here, then they stopped being here. Elohim is inconsistent. I don't trust him. Well, he seems fairly consistent to me. I mean, he's always been nice and told me to do things. Other than the whole not going to the tower thing. So weird. Okay. Oh, can I read these? Mm, no. Can't read the tombstones. I kind of figured out that this stuff isn't what it actually looks like, but I did not expect it to look like that. The short wall. Play button and an axe. Or whatever this is. Take platform. Platform can be used to have... Oh, I can not get to read that! What the hell? It's over my head. Have something carried on it. Why would we used to have something carried on it? Okay. Alright. What does it matter that I scribble my contempt on these walls if I am still surrounded by them? Well, dog, that sounds like a personal problem. 